Finance Minister Kalm Imbert has assured that public servants who accepted government's 4% offer will receive the monies before the end of the year. At a post-cabinet news conference last Thursday, Prime Minister Dr Kidrowley said that a permanent secretary wrote to the Finance Minister indicating that the back pay could not be paid in December, but he assured that government will do what needs to be done. Minister Imbert on Wednesday said the statement by Dr Rowley was about a permanent secretary at the Ministry of Education. They identify the additional resources that they need because the statement made by the permanent secretary in the Ministry of Education to his minister was based on the resources that they have at this time. But he assured that the Finance Ministry will be providing all resources necessary to ministries and the protective services to calculate the back pay and audits. That once everybody pulls together, we will achieve the back pay promise that we made to pay these categories of workers, teachers, prison officers, fire officers, police officers, by December 2023. December, we'll be trying, we're aiming for December 22, December 23, somewhere around there, and some will get before. Some might even get in November. But he reminded that only unions who have accepted a 4% offer would receive the back pay, noting that the Public Services Association and the union representing daily paid workers did not accept the offer. The PSA has not accepted it. So that I saw a lot of commentary about outside there from clearly mischievous people that the government has reneged on its promise to pay public servants by Christmas. That is not correct. He said the prison, fire and police services are in the process of finalising the payment files while the Defence Force is in an advanced stage. And Minister Imbert said they are working with the Education Ministry for the payment files for the 17,000-plus teachers. Sonolala, TTT News.